Hey guys, welcome to BRAN's Mini CTM Sandstone. We are back here in dungeon number two. Uh, just wanted to finish up and uh, finish up this area. I got most everything out of here. I'm just going to leave this stuff here. I, I don't need any of it, I don't think. Uh, I'll take some blocks because you know what? I didn't bring any blocks with me. I wanted to. Uh, Yeah, I don't know why I didn't bring any blocks with me. Go ahead and take that too. Uh, I wanted just to finish up this area. We still got that um, silverfish area down below. I don't expect it to be much of a problem, but you never know. And uh, I'm not going to destroy that spawner. I'm going to leave it. But I want to... Uh, oh, I hear a zombie, so... We still got... Got some guys spawning here. I don't know where he's at. Okay, so there's the spawner right there. I'm pretty sure that's what that is. So let's just go over here. Oh, there's one there too. I didn't see that one. Alright, let's just stop it. Block that off. There we go. All right, let's. Oh, these these guys. The knockback is what gets you on these. Where is that? Oh, there he is. Where did he come from? Oh. Where are you guys spawning from? Must be just dark areas. All right, let me eat something. I wonder if the, I wonder why I get so hungry. I wasn't even I wasn't even um, fighting these guys. I was just um, trying to put a block down. Oh, they must have went in. Yeah, see, they went in the other box, didn't they, the little boogers? So, okay. Is there any more of them? I wanted to get all this uh, iron and gold here. And I need to, I'm going to pick that up. Just so I don't do something crazy. Now, I, I'm guessing everything up there is done. Okay. What I wanted to do was do that. There we go. Now, what I can do then is just sit here. And, well, I guess I can't, can I? Yeah, see. Now the problem is, though, how am I going to get that? Hmm. How am I going to get that? Did you see how he hit me? How is he getting hit me like that? Little. I guess what I'll have to do is just do that. How's he hit me from way down there? The little cheaty. A little cheat. There we go. That way I can get uh, get some magma cream and uh, make up some some uh, potions when I need them. All right, guys. I'm going to. Uh, I don't see anything else. I'm going to gather up this stuff here, all of this uh, iron and gold that's down here. I've already made the block and, and all that stuff, so I will meet you back at the um, back at the base and we'll do a little bit of a recap, so I'll see you there. Hey guys, welcome back. So, we're back here at the base, brought everything back. Um, 
got a good haul. They've got a real good haul. There's 18 gold there. There's 40 there. So I had over a stack of gold. 24 iron to add to the 34 that I already got from the other. And I've already converted some of this over to golden carrots. Been uh, make, uh, Instead of the potatoes, I've been growing the carrots down there. So yeah, now I've also brewed up some potions here. We've got fire resist for eight minutes and we've got instant health too. I'm going to do a few more of the instant health since I've got so much gold. Uh, I'm going to make uh, probably a stack of golden carrots and then I'll have enough left over to make uh, some uh, instant health potions. I made them splash potions just for the emergency. These are all the, the potions that came, the little 10 second ones. I'm going to put those in there because I, I don't really know that they're all that useful. Um, here's the ender chest. What I did is I went up, I took, since we had two ender chests here, B-Ren gave us uh, two ender chests here. I took the other one and put it up there by the monument and left this one down here. So I figured, I'm assuming that's what, that's what they're supposed to be used for, but I don't. I don't know, but anyways, that's what I'm using it for. So there's the gold block. There's the block of iron, so those are done. I uh, only got four of the challenge fragments, so yeah. Probably not going to get all those, but I'm not too worried about that. Got the blue wool, and we got the cyan wool, so yeah, we are doing really, really well here. Uh, not too bad at all. This is all the the food stuffs that I've got. And then um, we'll go down here, and I'll just show you the little potion area that I've been working in kind of did a few little changes and just got it set up a little better do a little better manufacturing of the system there's the uh, cobblestone generator that you've seen already made a little infinite water spring there and uh, so there's my uh, uh, got five glistering melons so and I'll, I can make more of those uh, once that once that gold gets uh, uh, smelted down uh, probably before we head on into dungeon number two I'm gonna make a little uh, make a little gas killer box thing and we'll try that out that'll be fun I uh, got four of the magma cream, so that's pretty good. That's four times three, so that's 12 potions right there at eight minutes apiece. So that's that's going to do us, I think, probably for the duration of the map. Got some gunpowder, spider eye, which I'm not really going to use for anything. Glowstone, uh, which I got from the... Uh, where did I get that? I think it's from the monument box. or I don't know where I got that. I got that from somewhere. But, uh, of course, you know, you use that to bump up the... Uh, the health potions. I uh, need to make some more bottles, but I got plenty of glass there. So, yeah, guys, we are in a good shape. Got myself a little uh, uh, nether wart farm going there. And I do got some levels, and so I'm probably going to how much... Uh, yeah, see, I've got a whole stack of lapis, so probably going to do some enchanting as well. Get Do some... Uh, uh, once all the iron gets all smelted up, Take, take stock of what I have um, as far as armor wise and tool wise. I think I'm okay on tools for the moment at least. Uh, I've got 15 levels. So, I've got 41 arrows, so I'm doing pretty good on the arrows. So, yeah. So, yeah, so we've got a decent amount, so I'll probably. So you probably do do up some protection one armor because that's really the most cost-effective way to do it. I think I'm okay on the tools. That's efficiency one. That's efficiency two. But it's only halfway down. I've got another power two bow. Um, probably need some some weapons. I guess I lost. I thought I had an extra. Well, you know what? I probably lost it in the lava, didn't I? I bet I did. Uh, got my little fishing. I might do some fishing. See if I get anything, any books. Yeah, I probably need to do another sword. Um, yeah, because I think I lost the, the other ones, because this is the only one that I have. That's a sharpness too. So do up a sword, and uh, we'll do the little gas thing uh, next uh, episode. And then after that, we will head over to Dungeon 3. 
and uh, yeah see what that's all about it's a creeper or something or other so I'm sure it's got those big old blast creeper going situation over there that uh, we ran into and float so not looking forward to that but uh, <laughs> we'll see how it goes so doing better this time around though either the map isn't, hard, isn't as hard as float which is probably the case uh, or maybe I've gotten a little better I'm not sure but we're di uh, only down two deaths so not doing too bad at all and we've only got one more uh, wool to go <clears throat> and then we will uh, pretty much be done with this map I think uh, so yeah so I'll see you in the next one guys appreciate it bye bye now yeah.